I'm messing everything up. <laughs> You're not gonna mess anything up. We just gotta flip the whole farm. Are we each, each taking a line or? Take a line, yeah. Work your way down the line. Uh, take this one here. see anything in this one so don't worry about shaking those ones okay even if they're empty okay said if it's an empty one you don't have to shake it just flip it all mine are empty so far <laughs> looks like i fixed the easy line then huh yeah real dry So ready.
Now, I'm gonna lift the bag. This thing sinks. Sweet. Okay, so you're gonna catch. I, I dump, you catch. You're supposed to have the rookie doing all the hard work. <laughs> I hope I'm not missing any here. I don't think I am. Are they in? Oh yeah. Okay. Got a lot of them. Want some more? Yeah, I want them all. So now you can just pick those up and dump them in here, straight in the water. As much of the water as possible, and just dump them. Nice. Oh man. We're gonna do it again. Let's do it. Oh man, I hope I'm not missing these. Sweet. All right, I think I got them. There you go. Hold on a sec. Oysters. Yep. Dead one. How'd you know? Because it was open? Yep. So anything that's open. That's a big friggin' oyster. Yeah. Chin slapper. What'd what you, you call it? A chin slapper. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, so uh do this one, it looks pretty heavy. Alright. You want me to hold this? Yeah, you're gonna hold both. Okay. Of them. Gotcha. You really have to be a multitasker to do this. Exactly. Laura's usually good at holding on to the ropes. It's kind of her role in this whole thing. Do you want to swap up on the next one? I feel like you're doing all the work. That's all good. But yes, oh, man. if you want to dump one, you can do it. Usually you can get all a right, hole in cool. the basket. Go ahead and grab those last couple out of there. All right. There you go. Nice. Yeah, you're right. We did get a. You want it in the new but one or the old one? Old one. Yeah, we'll, we'll fill it up. Yeah, so, what we need to be careful of is you don't want the water to go over the edge of the bucket. Oh, it, and it sink it? Fast. Yep. That'd be terrible. Yeah. Yeah, we had it happen. That guy didn't get invited back, huh? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> that guy didn't get invited back. Exactly. Don't bring that guy oyster in anymore. <laughs> <laughs> nah, not at all. <laughs> okay, so we might put this on there. Put that on there. Close up these two guys. That's just like a crab trap. Same like closing method anyways. Well, so we used to, you'll see some of them had these metal pins on them. The metal pins are yeah, compared to this thing. This is much better than what we Oh, man. Doing. So when we switch to the 14 millimeter, this thing with the waves is taking a little bit of water. Yeah, you want to definitely try to keep the lip up. As much as possible. Uh, let's see, there's another sunk there. That one's heavy. There it is. I hate those little squirts, them. man. Those things are nasty. What do you call those? Uh, tunicates. Oh, tunicates. Sea squirts is the common name. That's what I've heard them called. All right, so we're going with this new bucket now, right? Yes. And actually, one of the things that you can do if it's taking on a lot of water is put the other one kind of in the middle there. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need to do that. And not lose this one also. I know exactly. <laughs> this is harder than it looks. Uh -huh. Well, it's harder than the wind. The calm, it's not as bad. So Friday would have been like unmanageable. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm coming out here in 30 mile an hour. <laughs> the truth of the matter is, normally if I didn't agree to a harvest, we wouldn't be out here now. Like you know what I mean? Yeah. I sort of committed to the day last week, made my best guess, and I was hoping it was gonna clear up today but no luck it's better than it will be friday i bet you that that's exactly right we'll do it in two all right nice Oh, Matt, no wonder these things are so expensive, man. This ain't an easy job here. 
Yeah, well, you know, could you imagine doing this all day long? Like, for me, it's fun to get out here in small doses. But, right. Uh, to do this as a full-time 40-hour a week. My back couldn't take it. Yeah. Uh, okay. <sighs> this one's pretty full, but it may not be too full. I don't know. I don't know how full is too full. Yeah. Uh, you want to take some? In, sitting low in the water. Let's do that one. Okay. I'm going to close this up. That's nice, the baskets are like holding that. Exactly. That's what I mean. Sometimes you get them in the middle of the water, right? Like surrounding and kind of keep taking on water. Alright, right, I'll grab this. Get this ready on the next one. Yep. How much do the little seeds cost that you buy? Three cents a, three cents a spat. A spat? Yeah, they call it a spat. A small baby oyster spat. So it's three cents for one centimeter. Huh. So it's like... Ten thousand of them were like... Three hundred? Wow. Yeah. Then you gotta put in all the man hours. <laughs> How long do they... So it's kind of nice because they... They pretty much, like, they just filter it, right? They just sit out here in the bag, come out every couple weeks and put the bags. Yeah, they're almost self-raising. It's kind of a little bit low, uh, exactly. low input. Okay, so I'll show you this. So I'll take, I got this thing, I got a hold of it. So you want to stand okay. at the bottom back here where I was at this end. Okay. And you want to, like, use your knees to hold the bag down and tilt it up. There you go. And then squeeze and break up all that biofouling. You know what I mean? Like, squeeze the mesh. Oh, there gotcha. you go. But poke that pin so that it protrudes kind of forward towards you. This end of yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. There you go. Oh, now you see. can clip it. That's it. Tom, it seems like you've done this before. I, I, you know, I've got a little bit of practice, especially with those cusp pins. I hate those cusp pins. <laughs> <laughs> they suck. And just clip it on here? Uh, put it on the one on the other side. There this one? Go, just on top. Yeah, just don't even clip it. Just set it. Okay. Yeah, exactly. That's what I mean. See, that other attachment's much better, right? What, the other? Oh, this one here? No, Without the, all the, the stuff? Blue, the blue clip that we had before with the rubber. Oh, yeah, a lot easier. A lot easier. There we go. Okay, now we're going to put this in there. All right. Man, these things just smell good. <laughs> Smell like at the restaurant. <laughs> nice. Cool. Uh, I think we got it. I think so. I mean, you guys have a basket. So go ahead and dump one and fill my basket. Okay. What do you think, oyster farmer? You what? So I could get a permit and do this at my house in Harker's Island. Yes. Where would I get a permit from? You might not want to forget them, huh? I know exactly. <laughs> Whoa! They are, man. Taking it right over the limb, huh? Oh yeah, you're normally a wetsuit guy, huh? How long do these normally take? A year to grow? I just 
did the same thing. Yeah. Activate your bilge pumps. <laughs> All right, it's y'all's time to shine now. Hey, Laura, you got this? Yep. So, Christian, you get one side, I get on the other. All right. If we want to do this from the bow, it's easier on the bow. Yeah, yeah it's easier on the bow. Don't trip over the line. Oh, man. <laughs> But for, yeah. yeah. Well, but with two people, so what you want to do is grab the edges here. Okay. Yep. Step overhead. Much easier on us. It's actually not that much harder down here. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. So this is where the term a bushel and a peck and hugs around the neck. <laughs> so oyster farmers are also prolific lovers. <laughs> oh, you get a lot of that uh, gumption from the uh, oysters. I've heard, I've heard. Clean. 